Hey Nathan here, welcome back to the last tutorial for the PGL2D Alpha series. And in this video we are going to create an extension method for the random class. So let's go to our solution explorer and let's go to the utility folder and add a new class. And I'm going to call this random ex. I'm going to make that smaller. So this is going to be a public static class, random ex. And this is just going to have one method for right now, public static int. So random, you can get a next or next double. Next can, is an integer value between a minimum and a maximum. I want to add a next odd, which is an integer value just it gets the next odd value. This random random int min int max int num so this is just gonna loop until we get a odd value. Do. Inside the do block we'll set num is equal to random dot next min comma max all right inside the while parentheses while num parentheses two is equal to zero so while the number is even we'll just repeat the process until it's odd return num So, the first thing we do, we use a do while because we need to set number to some value before we can check. So, do num is equal to random.next min max while the number is even, we repeat the process. If it is odd, we return num. Let's also, at the top, let's also add a check for if min is equal to max throw new argument exception we'll throw a new argument exception let's say max cannot equal min and for the parameter name let's set the parameter name to be max Uh, actually, we'll use the new name of action for max. Okay. So those two cannot be equal. If it is, it's going to throw an exception because if it is equal, it's just going to be a infinite loop. Because if you provide an even two, if you if you do, let's say, random dot next odd uh, two comma two random.next 2 comma 2 that's just going to return 2 so this will be an infinite loop so max cannot equal min okay so that's just a check that we need to implement for that so that's it for this video and this series I hope you enjoyed it so stay tuned for the next video which will just do a looking back on the series so I hope to see you next time.